Good morning, Willie Waffle. Well, good morning, and yeah, one of those big blockbusters comes out this week. It's The Mummy with Tom Cruise. Oh, I God. hate yeah. Tom Cruise. Yeah, me too. But anyway, what would you think? Well, I, I think Tom Cruise is the greatest action movie star to ever live. <sighs> no, so but when, I, he's, he's when he's so in an weird. action movie, or what should be an action movie, it should be pretty good. Yes. He's got that intensity. You feel that, 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 that look on his face when he's facing a possible death-defying moment. And in this movie... They try to make him into Bill Murray. They try to make him into the rascally, funny rogue who's always got something funny to say, except he's not funny. No, I don't uh, see him as being funny. No, and, and it really is not his forte, and, and I think it really hurts the movie. I think you've got to go with your strength in order to be better and to be the movie we want. Yeah. Uh, the plot is all over the place. It's got something to do with him unearthing this mummy who was uh, mummified while alive because she was evil, and now she needs his body to do something or other. But the problem is we don't spend time getting into that plot and getting into that story. We spend time building up what Universal is calling the Dark Universe, mm. where, where we're going to meet the Invisible Man, played by Johnny Depp. And Dr. Jekyll and Mr. Hyde, played by Russell Crowe. And they're spending all this time building this other stuff. They're forgetting about the mummy. She's, like, chained up in a corner someplace. Uh, what do you give this uh, summer blockbuster? I'm going one waffle. Wow. Oh wow. wow. Good wow. for you, Willie. And I hate Tom Cruise. Did I tell you that? <clears throat> you did. Yeah, you, yeah. you mentioned that. Yeah. <laughs> uh, what is this story, Megan Levy? What, what is this movie? Yeah, it's actually a true story about a Marine. Um, she joins the Marines because she's got kind of a troubled life. She ends up working in the dog kennels uh, where they, they train all the combat dogs. And, of course, she meets the meanest, roughest, toughest dogs they've got, and they become best buddies. And we watch them serving overseas, going off to the war zone, sniffing out bombs, trying to save soldiers from horrible, horrible incidents. Wow. And then the movie gets really emotional because they might get split up. Mm. Yeah, and it's a pretty good movie. I mean, for a true story, it's fairly predictable. I mean, you almost hate to say it's a cliche if it really happened, but I'm going to say three waffles for Megan Levy. Wow, that's nice. a good one. And ah, then, uh, you softy. And then uh, it comes <laughs> at night. Uh, what What is this one? This is the apocalypse type movie, right? Yeah, I mean, It Comes at Night is the worst title ever because nothing shows up. <laughs> it is one of the most boring movies you'll ever see in your entire life. You know, there, there's families, like, living out in the woods and some sort of zombie apocalypse or something going on. And then one day another family meets up with them. And now, you know, we're, we're trying to figure out who can be trusted and who's working against who and what's going to happen. And then nothing happens. Wow. Uh, and you give Spoiler this. Spoiler alert. <laughs> <laughs> and, and this one you give? I'm going zero waffle. Okay. Ooh. All right. Well, listen, I just love that you gave the mummy one waffle. I think that's mm -hmm. awesome. Uh, I do want to say, if you've not seen Wonder Woman, however, get out and see that one, right? Oh, absolutely. Wonder Woman is the action movie you wanted the mummy to be. Yeah. You know, it's got the fight scenes. It's got a great lead actress. It's got everything that's really just good in a movie. Uh, Davey gives it four waffles. What'd you give it, by the way? You you gave it three, I and, go three and a three, half. I go three waffles. Three I waffles. thought it was a very good, solid movie. You know, I, I thought it took a little time to get to the point, but man, when they get to the big grand climax of that final massive battle scene, that movie is rolling. All right. Well, uh, word is uh, the prediction is that Wonder Woman will be number one again this week, uh, this weekend. Oh, no doubt so, in my mind. No yeah. doubt in my mind. That's right. happening. Great stuff, Willie. Enjoy the week. Thanks so much. We'll talk to you next week. It's wafflemovies dot com. Talk to you later. All right. Uh, Willie Waffle is brought to you by Honest John's, and it's that time. we got a weekend that's going to be perfect, 90 and sunny and dry with low humidity on Sunday. So get the Honest John's out. Uh, Polish kielbasa, their, uh, their hot dogs, the Honest John's dogs, made right here in Utica and available at Hannaford, available at Kelly's Meat Market, Little Falls, Mohawk Village Market, Shenantries, and all over at Better Grocery Stores. They uh, have less salt. It's actually better for you than, uh, than other brands. It's Honest John's Hot Dogs made in Utica.